yo what's up um so we all know that i'm very um oh hey it's your boy in the flash holla um this light is so bright anyways so wait maybe you can see on my nose and i don't want you to see on my nose because i don't know if it's dirty right now so let me sit up um so get out of my face oh it's light anyways so we all know that Beyonce's album came out yesterday, and if we didn't know that, then you're an idiot. Yeah, you're just an idiot. Like, you're dumb. But anyways, we're not going to talk about you right now, because this isn't about you. This is about Beyonce and myself. Anyways, I didn't. I took a picture and I posted it, but the email didn't send when I sent it, so it didn't get posted, and then I paid it, and now it's the next day. So I figured, what better way to honor Beyonce, or the truth as I call her, than in my messy state of confusion. So, I woke up yesterday, excited like everybody else, I said, maybe I should just buy Beyonce's album on iTunes, because, you know, that's the hip thing to do. Um, I said, no, I'm not going to do that, Ugh, come on, who does that, you know, it's iTunes, whatever. So, I went to the store, Sunrise Records, HMB was too far, Sunrise Records, and bought my CD. My Deluxe Edition CD. So, you know, I'm... I'm I'm all for progression. I really am. Like I'm I'm not against it. I'm all for progression. So I have an iPod. And I have this cute little mini laptop here. Which by the way doesn't play CDs. So I rush to the store to buy Beyonce C D and open it. And look at all the pictures, even though I saw them because of the website and the release and everything like that. I read all the credits. I realized that the Dream wrote more than one song. And I believe he's a nightmare. But hey, if Beyonce, if, if he can make Beyonce sound good, or if Beyonce can make him sound like he's a great writer, slash producer, more power to the both of them. Anyways, back to my CD. So I bought the CD, opened it up, looked at it, read the credits and all that stuff, and realized that I couldn't play the CD because I don't have a CD player anywhere other than my house. So essentially, I cannot enjoy the Beyonce CD anywhere except inside my house on my stereo over there. Why is that disturbing me? Because I want to hear it all the time. So now I'm thinking to myself, well, maybe your dumbass should just bought the damn CD on iTunes. Because then you would have been able to have it on your iPod that you carry with you everywhere. And you'd have been able to listen to Beyonce. I I Again, I'm all for progression, but but laptops without C D ROM drives and 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 stuff just Anyways. I got the C D and guess that's all that really matters. I always feel like an idiot because I'm just like, you knew you weren't going to be able to listen to the CD because you don't have a CD player. So why would you go out and buy the CD in anticipation to listen to the CD knowing full well that you can only listen to the CD inside your house? S-M-D-H. Anyways. I'm in my house waiting for Snoopy to get dressed so that we can go to this rehearsal with Vixen and this light is fucking blinding me. I guess it's early, so I'm a little irritated with everything because, yeah, I'm just, yeah. I know it's like after 12, but you know, it's still early for me and we all know, well, if you don't know, you should know that I am not... A morning person. This is my job. Um, anyways, going by Beyonce CD, it's amazing, duh. 
And if you don't agree, you're an idiot. My words, and I'm saying, I'm saying it's your face. You're an idiot. I'm going to go now and shower. Wait, no, I don't need to shower. Wait, yeah, I'm a shower. I'm a shower. I'm a shower. Ha! I'm gonna shower and then go to rehearsal and then find somewhere to sleep because I am just tired of life. Anyways, oh, FYI, I have a new pride picture coming out this week, so look out for that. And, um, yeah, holla. Oh, it didn't work.